Can you taste it? No, don't worry, you haven't tuned into the wrong channel. We're talking this week about you and the extent to which you need to taste new social media platforms before they're big, when they're big, and new marketing opportunities that you might be letting go because you simply don't want to invest the effort in something new. Welcome to Weekly Marketing Thoughts with CTG Intelligence, your weekly look at marketing, PR, business development, top tips and tactics for your career or organization. Please hit that thumbs up button below and click subscribe so that we can uh, show you more content just like this. So I'm sure you all heard of TikTok and I'm sure you once heard about Facebook. But did you at any stage, now be honest, say, I don't know if I want to invest the time because I don't know if it's going to become big. What I want to say is that it doesn't matter if it's going to become big. What matters is that there's a community there that you can interact with and add value to. So some of the latest ideas that people are swirling around the internet is that you should maybe dabble with the app Caffeine, which is a, a platform built by ex-Apple designers you know, to create live broadcasts. Perhaps uh, Lasso by Facebook will morph into something that competes with TikTok. Uh, perhaps House Party, which we use, uh, will be more of a business tool because it enables you to not just have a meeting, but do something in that meeting, like play a game. Um, maybe Steam It, uh, which, which is sort of a, a Reddit competitor, um, or, or, albeit on a crypto uh, you know, wave. And of course, TikTok itself. You might think, well, it's not for me. What you need to think about is that one, just because there isn't a uh, business development base for you in that place doesn't mean there won't be but you will never know unless you taste it if you have a look on the app store obviously make sure it's a legitimate app and you look at all the cons security considerations look at what's trending and taste it because you can get a sense of what's next additionally let's say you go on tiktok and you make some videos that are quite funny uh maybe TikTok will never explode for you. I think it will be fine for the security field, but let's say it's never going to explode. You can apply what you learned on TikTok to the next Schmidt talk or whatever it's called. The skills you learn on one can be applied to another. Uh, everybody learned stuff on Vine that they applied to YouTube. Everyone learned stuff on MySpace that, that they, they applied to Facebook. Don't be so reticent to try new things because one, a community is valuable and it may give you another opportunity to actually find uh, an inroad for your message. Maybe you'll discover that your message is better presented in glamorous photos with motivational quotes on Instagram. Maybe you'll find that perhaps what you're trying to achieve can be you know, better understood uh, over a really long time on Twitter, where many times a day you're hammering home your message. Don't be too proud to use something new. Don't be too fearful that it will go away. Because for the time that it is there, it is of value to you. And let's say it's only there for a month. What you learn in that one platform will be valuable for the next. It's a short look at how you can taste in order to learn and grow and uh, develop your business. Of course, we don't know what's next. And of course, you need to maximize what's now. So, you know, this doesn't, uh, you know, preclude uh, the really good advice that perhaps there will not be a next LinkedIn and that LinkedIn right now is the only thing that matters. So this doesn't preclude you capitalizing on what is really strong now because they might never come again. Google AdWords in the early 2000s that was so cheap. No, that, that, that won't come again. Uh, Facebook AdWords did become very, very, very affordable in the first uh, days of lockdown in the pandemic. 
and yes, that that's gone away. It's gone back, uh, you know, up again. But that's not the point. So this week, I want you to taste something new. Uh, obviously, make sure it's a legitimate app. Make sure that the security considerations are are fine. But there's tons on the top Apple or um, Android uh, App Store that you can look at. And it might feel a little silly at first. It might feel a little counterintuitive. But no one's going to judge you for it. And you've only got something to gain in learning about how it works. So uh, maybe comment, uh, say which platform you've had a go with. Um, maybe join us for a house party session this week. Look for Jay Watson, CTG Intelligence. If you want to play a trivia quiz, we often do with a few people, even from America and from the Middle East and, and, and Europe, it, you know, it, it all pops up. So uh, tell me what you're tasting this week. And uh, if you think you found the next big platform, use it capitalize on it for as much time as is possible. So I look forward to seeing you next week, uh, but please hit that thumbs up button below and subscribe uh, to see more content just like this.